Hello, hello, hello! Daycan here. Welcome back to Tiptera Cola. Last episode, well, Layla died. Yeah, the game's starting not to pull any punches. Okay. I said we might go in a prana out of, but I've changed my mind. You've got really no reason to go in there unless you just want to go kill the critters around there. But, we do have to move on with the storyline. Way to go? Oh, like it. Everything in the second part, you go to Aziz. Yeah, he's over here. Come on. Well, at least we don't have to traipse around the map keep, to keep finding him. He's always in one spot. Come on. Maya, I had feared the worst. We weren't able to stop the Doomsday device. The brain was indestructible. Alisa returned and took the plans to the device. I fear she plans on beating Doskius at his own game. But she helped us. She worked with us only to get her hands on the Doomsday plans. Time will tell if she's as reckless as Doskius. She most likely is. But where do we go next? Well, someone we haven't talked to about in a long time. Do you know where Tori has gotten to? He was here looking for you. Perhaps Uncle knows where he is. Yep, we're running after that brat again. It's been over 50 episodes since we saw him. Right. All the way back to Oasis. Go see Uncle. Come on around those corners. Now, in we go. And yes, there is a reason led in talking to my party. Maya, you're safe. Did you stop the treachery on Shell 3? That was only the beginning. A chosen warlord known as Doskius has gone against his people with the belief that he is the savior of Septera. I fear his warlike nature will be the destruction of us all. I'm ashamed that Tori had a part in all of this. Unwittingly, perhaps, but a part nonetheless. Doskius has meddled with the balance of the core. It may be disastrous for us all. Aziz would be better able to help in these matters. Yeah, we're already dealing with that, but I do need to talk to you. Have you heard from Tori? He's been up to his old mischief. He sold something to Mayer, some sort of device Mayer used to reprogram the workbots. Where did he get it? In the factory. No one's ever been in the factory. He said he was going back. Oh boy, what is he up to now? Well, we're gonna go actually to the factory. This is one of the areas that was locked off early game and we could never get to. And well, it's finally opening up. Now. Come on. So we go up here. There's the factory. Tori, where have you been? Hey, Maya, I didn't mean to do it. Do what? I found a way to sneak into the factory. I found some neat stuff. You mean stole? Uh, and I... I brought it back out. Mayor offered me 500 coin for it. I couldn't refuse. What was it? So, something he used to reprogram Grub's workbots. It's terrible. The workbots being used to kill is horrible. No, no. I mean, it's terrible that I didn't ask for more money for the thing. I didn't know it was that valuable. <sighs> oh, you never learn, Tori. Well, if the technology came from the factory, then perhaps whoever lives inside can also help us to stop it. But no one else has ever been inside. You were inside? How did you get in? I tried to go through the front gate. I even opened it. But there's this weird light behind it. So I snuck in through a small pipe. Too small for you to fit. Then we'll have to find another way. I'll, uh, I'll leave you to it then. Oh no, you stay right where you are. Well, there is one way to do it. It's the factory. This place has been here long before the Junkers. Nobody knows who lives inside. 
Oasis ships its scrap metal here. I wonder what they use it for. Well, we do have the key to get in there, and it's... Oh, good. This is a dimensional gate. A demon's gate. Really? Marduk's demon sword technique is built upon such principles. I think I can open it. I can't hold it for long. Well, let's go then. Where are we? Inside the factory, I hope. Who knows where the gate leads to? Who enters the Hall of the Watchers? Um, Maya of Oasis. I come seeking help. The children seek the help of the old. Our mayor has used one of your devices to reprogram our robots. We need your help to- Great birds see the ants, but the ants do not realize their audience. You know of our troubles? We wish to help you right the wrong. We who watch are great healers, not destroyers. Great healers? How great? Can you heal my love, Layla of the Seven Winds? Seven Winds? We can but try. We will need a healing plant of the Lens Jungle of Shell 4, and an ancient talisman of the Chosen, which they left behind on their trek to the Upper Shell so long ago. But the Lens Jungle hasn't been traversed for ages, since Marduk's people left Babylon. The people who left Marduk City became the Chosen. How do you know so much of the Chosen and their history? Time brings all answers to those who wait. Here, this device will reverse the programming of your mayor. Use it on his central computer. He has another device which was stolen from us, a key to the ancient canal system on Shell 4. Retrieve it from the mayor and use it to gain access to the ancient lens jungle of our ancestors. There, you will find the healing plant that we require to help save your friend. And this other talisman? You will find it in an ancient chosen temple on Shell 6. Thank you. Return when you have what we require. Hmm. Well, they're a bit cryptic. Hopefully we get some answers. But you can chat to them. They don't... They pretty much run around in loops. <laughs> uh, come on. Down the path. Stop glitching on those stairs. There we go. So, where do we go? And of course, Tori's gone. <sighs> Can't stay in one spot, Kenny. Where do we go next? Well, go again. I'm gonna steal stuff off you and bring out Grub. Where is it? Oh, there. Alright. Where do we go? Oh, we're going to the Spelter Complex. And we're fighting Workbots. Alright. Come on. Okay. Uh, chaos. Mirror. Law. And this is one of the, the other powerful attacks, just like Marduk. This is called the Big Bang Attack. Broken magic systems are wonderful. Yeah, from now on, abuse as much magic as you can because well, it's the only way you're going to get through the fights quick enough. I know there's one attack, I'm trying to remember it. What? Chaos? Or... Ah, this one. Law, chaos, and mirror creates black hole. And it's just as powerful. And 
fine, hey, we're not taking any damage. Oh yeah. This area is pretty short short and straightforward, so we won't be here too long. So yeah, we've got one hit kill cards now and well, an easy section. Come on. Ah, there is Rochelle yet yellow. It's just a slightly different colour. It's pretty much the same as the other workbot. Yeah. Repair. <laughs> yeah. That's why I'm not doing that in here because, well, it's just not worth it. Though, they do run off. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Just whack it upside the head. No need to waste all that magic. <laughs> Gonna need that later for oh, bigger events. want to clear the path out of here because well um okay we'll want to come back through here so come on guys um heal back up and I did not mean to get in the menu there we go one more fight if I remember and up another level right Nope, one more fight. Ah. And before me. That's a good sound. Attack! Kill them! Miss Maya, how are you? No, you idiots! Attack them! Kill! Rend! Destroy! I can't hurt my friends. I miss them. Oh! What are you guys doing here? We're tired of being pushed around. Yeah, we're here to kick ass and take names. You'll all pay for this. No, we won't. Let's get him. Bye! And he's never seen well, again. Well, I hope they don't hurt him too bad. <laughs> Kanalki. Right, so, where do we go next? Well, we go to the canals. So, um, oh, the World Bazaar. I always forget what name of the shell that one is, but farewell. Oh Come on. Arr, driving, driving. So, I'll leave that for next episode. Uh, shell 5? No, shell 4. <laughs> I always get one off. <laughs> anyway, this is Daycard signing off. Bye! What's... Hmm. I don't know what's so difficult about that one. It has a second phase! <laughs> Dice. You pathetic and wretched excuse for worry.